What's up everybody, it's me, Michael McCune, coming at you with another video. Today, I'm bringing you 31 Days of Horror, Day 9. I'm way behind, so I'm going to get them all done today, all the way up to today. So, this is October 25th, today, and yesterday was my birthday, so if you want to wish me happy birthday in the comments below, go ahead. Um, But today is Hellfest, and this is... A slasher film placed on Halloween um, amusement park um, some of y'all know what this movie is because it did come out uh, it came out in 2018 so not too long ago but Hellfest is a giddy and almost a heroic horror experience so yeah, there's one of the killers. Um, there's the back. Um, it is also from an exclusive producer of The Walking Dead. Um, so this film was a um ten out of ten for me. Um, this film was really good. Um, it's one of these. One of these films, I feel like that was pushed um, back a little bit, um, like pushed back in the corner a little bit from the popular horror films that came out that year. So I feel like I would put it in here. Um, so that's one reason why um, a lot of people probably won't know what this movie is, but um, a lot of horror fans might know what it is. Cause it's not like it's not like any other ones I put it on this year's um list. So, but it is a really good slasher film. Um, and um, set in, on Halloween in a carnival, um, amusement park. So, really creepy costumes, really, really cool shit. Um, I'll probably end up watching it. Um. Probably tonight or a couple of days, whatever. A sad Halloween. It's the end of Halloween already. Um, can't believe it already, but I mean, but it's a group of friends who are bound for a horror themed Halloween event at a local amusement park. It's for all the rides, games, mazes that travels, you know, around the country. It happens to be in town, but basically, you know, they have fun getting on the rides and shit like that, but. After they get, like, after it's almost time, like, for them to leave and stuff, these killers start coming after them, and they just start killing them one by one, so. But, uh, that's basically what it's about, um, they're just trying to survive the night, really, um, um, Lionsgate put this out, um, uh, 89 minutes, so it's an hour and a half, so not too bad for, um, uh, what you call it, for run time, uh, but yeah, I love the cover art on this, I love the masks and the costumes, they did a really good job. Um, I can't think of, I've only seen it once, so, I mean, yeah, I thought I'd throw this in there, um, it's one of the, um, moderate ones we've gotten over a couple years, or a few years, actually not a couple, but. five years ago, so, anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this, um, video, please like and subscribe for more, next one's coming up right now, peace out.